Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about a topic that I am an expert at, that I'm a professional at. No one is better than me at this one. Oh no. The, you, can, you can challenge me at skincare, you can challenge me at, at makeup and at whatever beauty product there is. But if there's one product that I'm a professional at, it's lip balms. Lip balms. I have used lip balms since I was 11, 12 years old. I have fuller lips, so as you can see, my lips tend to dry quickly. So I have tried every lip balm known to man on this earth. And I can personally give you my honest opinion on what works and what doesn't. What's greasy and what's not. And what lip balm will you find yourself reusing and reapplying every hour. I know the ins and outs. So really my neighbor decided to, you know, make a lot of noise and change his house while I'm doing a review. We're going to ignore that. So we are going to review the best lip balm on earth. I have tried Labello. I have tried Baby Lips. I have tried Yves Rocher. I have tried Mixa. I have tried every brand, every label, whatever there is. First of all, I love them. Second of all, I love the smell. Third of all, I love to see which one is the best. Now, listen to me very carefully. The best lip balm on earth will be revealed soon. But first, let me tell you something about this one. La Bella one is great, but it, for people with fuller lips like myself, I find myself reapplying this every hour or two, so it's not the best. Mixa one, it's great. It's like La Bella. you have to reapply. Uh, the ones that have a little color on it, the baby lips one, they dry out your lips. Just saying. Mixa. This probably sucks. This is the worst of them all. Yves Rocher. In between that. Now the best lip balm on earth. Ladies and gentlemen. Let me present to you. The classic Carmix. This is a mix. You know Vaseline is too thick to put on your lips. It's too greasy. Imagine if... Labello and Baby Lips had a baby with Vaseline. Hey, that's Carmex. That's their illegitimate child. Now, let me tell you something. The Carmex one plumps your lips. It, it just smells amazing. This is the color, by the way. It's like a yellowy color. There are also some that are vanilla scented. This is the best lip balm on earth. This one plumps your lips. It hydrates. You don't have to reapply it every hour. It's the best one on earth. Ladies, for people who love using lipsticks as makeup, this is a great base. A lot of people use this before they apply anything else. I just like it because the smell is amazing and it's very, it's very hydrating. I don't find myself reapplying it every hour. This is the best lip balm that I've tried in 25 years. Now, I want to know what you guys use as lip balm and what's the best for you. Remember, if you don't have lips that dry out as quickly, these will work fine for you. But you have, if you have lips like mine that tend to dry quickly, this one doesn't play. This one, this one is a game changer. Okay, y'all, so special shout out to Carmix for creating such an amazing lip balm for people who have lips that dry out quickly. Mwah, thank you. On the comments below, let me know what your favorite lip balm is. And don't forget to click on the notification bell. Share, comment, and subscribe, and see you on the next one.